Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to another episode of Dealer Simulator. Today's a big one. We have purchased our first vehicle. I did get it unstuck in the last episode, as you can clearly tell. And yeah, we're going to see how much we can get for this thing today, because i got to earn some serious cat cash. I have some bills to pay, and uh, yeah, big goal today. I don't know if we'll get it or not. I need a th I think it's 33 grand for the bigger storefront. I'm just sick of going all the way to the edge of the map to reach my storefront. So I would love to get that big one. I don't know if we'll be able to fill it today or not, but I would love to get that that way. Uh, we don't have to travel so far every day just to go sell our stuff. Cause yeah, this storefront truly is annoying. All right, this is said to be about 33,000. So not bad considering we paid 17 for it. Uh, I think I'm gonna try and go higher. I don't ever do this, but being that this is such a big item, I would love to get a bit more money for that. And we'll periodically put all this junk on the um, racks. That way we can sell that as well. Why can't I get in my own store? What is going... Hello? D -d Did you lock me out? What is going on? Okay, can you open the door for me? Can 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 you please let me... What happened? How did the... How do they get in? Oh, how did I break it? I haven't even done anything. And I already broke the game in this episode. Is, is there like a back door now? Yes, but it doesn't exist. Okay, there. There. What? Okay, there. There. I, I had to close it and open it. Sorry I didn't sell whatever it was to you. I hope it wasn't the muscle car. All right, I paid my bill. It was $2,200, so we are officially out of money. That was just employee fees. So, uh, yeah, I guess these guys won't quit on me. I wonder. I wonder if I could cheese the system by having an item in two slots. Would it sell twice? I doubt it, but I'm trying to break things. Okay, so yeah, now we got Hello Space 5 twice. We'll see what happens here. All right, got someone on the car. I just... All right, I would love to get just 33,000. I don't think anybody's going to go over 33. And yeah, this guy isn't either. So I'm going to send away. At least I know they come when I'm asking for jerk-off prices. Oh! Oh! I didn't actually expect him to take 33,000 because he only offered 27. But I guess he's the proud owner of my car. And he walks out of here for some weird reason. Okay, cool. Are they coming from the pits of hell now? So yeah, they have uh, changed the... Um... <laughs> The spawn in for the uh, customers. That way they don't get stuck in the doorway anymore. If you don't know, they used to get stuck here. Um, so yeah, they still pop into existence here. You, you think they come from down the street or something. All right, well, there's not much else here today, so I'm just going to sell it. I don't even care, dude. I'll, I'll just sell it all for dirt cheap. I just I just want to empty my store because it feels good when it's empty. All right, I'm getting sick of seeing people just poured out of existence, not interested in my wonderful stock store of two different shoes. One, for whatever reason, a hundred... Wait, what? No wonder why nobody's freaking buying this. What is up with you, man? Are you okay? Research the prices on the shelf. I was like, oh man, I got some great shoes here for $175. No wonder why nobody's coming in the store. You're selling $10 shoes for $175 freaking dollars. And these ones were $35 for some reason. Now they're $10 again. All right, well, is there even a point staying here for $20? No, I'm just going to close this. Oh, this guy did want to come in. Sorry, buddy. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't have my truck here. That's okay. This is a video game, so we can go to vehicle. Oh, we're at the auction house. Okay. Well, first and foremost, I got to sell this truck again to probably the <laughs> dealership that hates me because I keep buying and selling cars to it for zero profit. But yeah, I guess technically we could buy the store right now if we wanted to, but we've already made that mistake once. So let's get a nice stockpile of money. That way I can actually, you know, fill the store with things because last time I did that, it took me forever to fill my store and I didn't even really fill it. So we'll spend this week seeing how much money we can earn. Uh, we have the auction once a week. You got to remember that once we finish up the auction, whatever we have, we'll invest into a bigger store. All right. I don't think we're going to go true big boy. Well, we can't because I would have no money. Uh, I think we're going to go for the big starless 350 though. Let's increase our space. And um, one day we'll get the truly big guy, but uh, this should be great because uh, I think this one's pretty big. It's not this one. It is this guy over here. So yeah, not a huge increase from the small box truck, but definitely a little bit better. We should at least be able to store four or five different uh, storage lockers in this. And this one actually somewhat drives okay, which is shocking in this game. Most of the vehicles are absolutely awful. Well, first locker, and we got another gun. So I don't know why I had such a hard time getting guns before. Now I'm doing great. Nice thousand dollar camera too. Okay, I haven't even gotten into the boxes yet, and we definitely broke even at least. All right, and the boxes had pretty much junk in it, except for that I-5, which is only 170. So not the best locker, not the worst. Okay. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. So we got two RC cars and what is this? It's broken. Oh, it's an airsoft gun. 
I don't think I've gotten any of those yet. Okay, got the uh, double jewelry. So not great jewelry, but still good amount. Great thing about this is we're not really getting too many big items. So I might actually be able to go to the other's place as well and buy four lockers there. Because yeah, we still have so much room in this upgraded truck. <gasps> oh, I just saw the Rolex in front of me too. I'm searching this right now. Let's get another Rolex on top of that. Okay, I don't know how that RC car fits in that small bag, but I'm not going to question it. And yeah, we got a $1,200 Rolex. Not the best one, but hey, better than nothing. The heck is this jewelry? It's a bag. How How is a bag jewelry? All right, I'm not going to complain. It's a $350 bag and I got an NES as well. They're $600. So what a locker that one was. Well, I asked for a car. I didn't expect that one, but I haven't seen one of these in a while. So that's kind of exciting. Yeah, I'm just going to put it on my face. Nice. God damn, we got a 7,900. Okay, so we didn't get anything crazy in this haul of four storage lockers, but we got a lot of $1,000 items, so uh, I really can't complain. I was really hoping for some major items, though, but I don't think we're ever going to find any major items. Okay, how many episodes am I in? I seriously thought this was only one storage house. It is two. I thought they just accidentally put two emblems on the map. No, these are two exact buildings side by side with two different storage places so you know what i've never been to this one let's go purchase from this guy who looks exactly like the other guy yeah a lot of the same old uh, occupations in here at least we got a lot of options i'm gonna go for big boys because i got lots of money and i'm here to earn some cash damn it so there we go i think that's all i can buy right yep but yeah, good to know. If I do want to buy a crap load of uh, auction sites, uh, I could buy eight total here instead of uh, four at the other place. All right, I thought we'd open them all up at the same time just to get a quick glimpse. And uh, yeah, looks like we got some decent items and some not so decent items as per usual. Whoa, I never saw that. $900, not bad. We got a new guitar. I did know they added new guitars to the game, so that's good. Starting to get worried. I might actually have bought too many uh, lockers. We're only on the second one. And uh, I think we're going to run out of space soon here. Check out this gaming tower too. You can't really see it well here. But 1350 that is by far my most expensive tower. It's not even a square. That's so cool. All right. Well, there we go. That's two days of work just buying storage lockers. By the time we get back to our store, it'll be nighttime. So uh, we'll probably just leave. Why can't I? All right, whatever. I don't care. Just leave it there. I'm rich at this point. <laughs> but yeah, perfect size. Uh, we got just enough space for pretty much all that. Thankfully, we didn't get any big items today, so it wasn't too bad. What is that? That must be a work in progress over there. Okay, and after two days of buying, today's going to be a very stressful day because I'm hoping to sell all of this today. Oh, I doubt that's going to happen, man. That There is so much in here. It doesn't look like a lot, but damn, there is. What? I would love to sell the Hertz M300. I'm clicking the button. What if we bargain for... Why is it 900? Clo what? Just freaking buy. Send away. I... Well, damn it. Okay, what's going on? I, ca I can't sell... This is a problem. I can't sell things. All right. I'm going to have to refresh the store here. Get out of here. I don't know what broke. I don't, got, I don't got time for things breaking. I got so much to freaking sell, man. Okay. That seemed to have fixed it. Oh, God. Did I forget to pay my employees again? Where wh where did they go? Okay. Well, I guess we'll just sell the rest of this stuff here. Ooh, finally, somebody wants to buy this for a good price. I want $1,200 still. I am, I am a cheap man. That's right. Get out of here. Damn it. Okay. Well, what do I do until I can figure out my employee situation? Like, seriously, all I have is in my bank is my loan. I wasn't warning me that I have payments to do. That's in my mail. I don't know where my employees went. All right, well, even if my employees quit on me, day one was a complete success. We are at $12,000. It might not look like I have a lot on the ground, but the majority of my jewelry and small high ticket items are still very much here. So all we got to earn is five grand on this and we'll profit. We'll definitely earn five grand. I got to sell the rest of this tomorrow because, well, hopefully my employees will be there. I don't want to have to manually do anything. All right, are my employees back? They are. So I guess they do have shifts. I didn't actually know that till now. I usually don't sell that late. All right, so should be an easy day. We'll open up. I don't want to have a lot of stock on me because I don't actually know when the auction day is going to be. So I want to empty this stock out before I buy anything else. And this should be a lot of high ticket items. As I said, there's a lot of jewelry and tech here. Okay, and that is it. We have officially sold everything on the ground. I just have all my uh, actual shelves stocked right now. We are at 21400 So yeah, we earned quite a bit of money doing this. Not too bad. Good time for my guys to uh, leave. We actually did uh, do that perfectly. 
because everything is priced except that one item I just put down. And I'm going to try and stay here and sell the rest of this, hopefully. Okay, and that is another full day of selling. We still got a few items that are high ticket, like this camera and whatnot, but the majority of it is pretty much junk. So we'll probably buy two more or three more lockers tomorrow. Again, I don't want to have a lot of stock on hand because I do know the auction is going to be... I don't know if it's five days or seven, uh, but if it is five, the auction will be tomorrow. So yeah, we'll try and get a bit more stock just to have another day of selling and uh, then we'll get there and try and earn a bit more. Oh, it is auction day. Okay, great. So I guess we're not going to be buying another storage locker. So it is like a work week. So five days between auctions. I officially have remembered that now, hopefully. So that's kind of nice. We actually might still have time to do one locker today. You got to remember, I have all day to do this. So I think I'm just going to buy one or two lockers still, see if we can get lucky. And uh, then we're going to have a big auction day. I'm hoping to get a bunch of items, uh, both vehicles and collectibles would be nice. So yeah, I'm just going to buy anything that's kind of cheap. I think I'm just going to buy the two cheap ones. Again, I don't want to get too much stock in case I don't have enough time to sell it. So we'll quickly grab that and get selling today. The more money we have, the better. All right, so I'm in a rush. So I'm just going to throw everything as I look at that. Two PC cases in the first one. Uh, but yeah, I'm not even going to check these items. I'll deal with it when we get back to our base. I just want everything in here. We'll open it up and get there nice and quick. Ooh, that looks nice. Yeah, nice. $350 picture. That's the most expensive picture I've seen. See, it pays to buy the cheap freaking storage units, I swear. All right, I did that in record time. That seems to be the way to do it. I don't know why I didn't do that before. Just throw the bi the bins in here and open them up, them up in the truck. Saves time transferring it. Come on, give me a bike or something. I haven't seen anything cool in a while. Okay, a cleaner C. You know what? I'm happy with that. We actually got an electric guitar as well. Not an expensive one, but hey, it's something... A gamer chair. Nice. Don't smell that. All right. And the final box. Throw it in. Open it up. I don't even care what's inside. Speed running this crap. Let's get back to the store and sell. All right. I think I'm going to get out of here. Uh, I did not sell as much as I hoped for, but uh, we did definitely profit. We got 25 grand now. So I got a few more items in here. There's still obviously a few items in the store. I want to make sure we have enough time today. I don't want to run the risk of the auction closing or something. So as I empty this truck, I'll just sell anything else again. I'm not, I'm pretty much, okay, it's broken again. I can't even sell anything anyways. I don't know why that's happening. It's driving me freaking nuts though. All right, that's fine. There's not much items anyways. I'm just emptying the truck because we're going to sell this back. All right, let's waste no time. Get over to the car dealership, get all of our money and go hopefully earn lots in the auction house. Okay, we are sitting with $41,000. Oh, hey, a free laptop. Yay, thank you. Okay, I hope there's some good cars today. I would love one big car. That way I can just sell that and earn a lot of money. So yeah, we'll do the car auction first, see if we can get one of those. We got the Chi Camaro again. Last one we got for 22. I know they're worth 33, so uh, we will bid on this, but I would hope for a different car. But if I can get this for under 20, I'll probably do it just because why not? Okay, it's gone. And it looks like this is going to go for about 22 as well. I should have looked up the car prices. It seems like with the auction house, you're pretty much always going to profit, though. I hope. All right, give me a better car. Give me something better. Come on. What? Dodge a uh, dude's chart. All right, this is already at 20,000. So uh, I think I'm going to have to win or try and fight for this one. I don't know how much this is worth. 25. Oh, God. I want some money for the other auction. All right, screw it. I'm going to try for the final car. I'm too picky. I might regret this decision, uh, but that would be all my money almost. All right, please. Yes, this is what I wanted. The ply bird. <laughs> this thing just looks so cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right, the ply bird is next level. Oh my God. I can't believe I just, oh, I just wasted my auction day. I mean, we can still win a bunch of the small items. I should have went for the Camaro though, because I know that was, that would have been a freaking $13,000 profit almost. Oh, wait, I forgot. Oh, God. Oh, God. I forgot I can only do one a day. Dude, I can't make this crap up. So I reloaded the game because I didn't want to ruin my auction day. Okay, let's try that again. Now, this time, uh, we're going to go for the ordinary auction. At least with this, I can pretty much guarantee that I'm going to uh, get a few items. Well, at least a couple. Because I can afford these things. So uh, if we have any money left over, we'll obviously... Well, actually, we can't go to the car auction. What am I saying? You can only do one of these, which is the stupidest idea, in my opinion. At least let people go to both auctions. And it looks like I'm going to win Sultan for 10400 I feel like that's a good deal for a piece of art. Now we have 
a statue. It looks like a really cool statue, too. Oh, yeah, that's that's an expensive item. Oh, my God. I kind of want this. I actually do really want this thing. So I'm going to be aggressive for it. And we'll see if I win at 24. I can do one more. Oh, uh, do I wait for the next thing or do it? I'm doing it. I can't do it. Okay, so it's too high. This one will definitely be able to get it started at 1,000. So it's going to be a cheap item, which is good. Because I might still have enough money for that Camaro if it pops up. Oh, yeah. I Why do I keep thinking that I can go into that thing? I can't go into the other auction. We're having a crazy bid at the end here. I don't know why. All right. It was at 2,000. We almost got it. Stop bidding! I have to win it. All right. 5,000 and 10,000. So a $15,000 investment. And we actually did get both. I just want to see if because I won something. No, I can't go into the other one either. Here are my items. What do we got? Jesus, 20,000. So that is 100% profit and 5,000 on this. Okay, so we've learned a valuable lesson. You can actually lose money. It looks like we are going to lose just a little bit on this. That's okay. Um, it's a good thing I uh, checked that. What is going... What do you... What? Are you trying to sabotage me? I just literally had him check the prices. He's trying to sell this for $45. What are you doing? Dude, this game is just crumbling around me. What is going on on this episode? Can we have 20000 for this, please? I really hope this thing isn't, like, bugged and people are only going to offer, like, $60 for it or something. Uh, anyways, might be the last... Well, should hopefully is the last day here because I just got two items to sell and a bunch of junk items. And then we're getting out of here and moving on. Oh, well, that was easy. Okay, there's the blessing gone. I still lost, like, $300 on that, but it's gone. Now I just have to wait for the big Sultan, and I'm really nervous about this because I don't know if I'm going to get that money or not. All right, well, I was offered 11000 so that technically would be profit, but uh, yeah, we're obviously going to wait for a much better deal than that. Ah, well, that was not long at all. <laughs> this person just really <laughs> wants to win this bit, this bid. So because you offered me that, I'm going to try and profit because it's very close to my price, please. Ah, uh, 20000 then. Just, just... Get it out of my life. 20000 There you go. Thank you. Oh, $47,000. All right. We'll just let the, re the rest of this stuff sell, and then we'll get the hell out of here. We still have this camera. I really want this thing to go. All right. Store closing. I'm going to literally accept anything for these. Oh, God. I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. Seven fifty. Of course someone comes for the camera now. All right. Whatever. I'll just... Oh, that's too bad. I can't sell because the game's broken. Okay. Too bad. All right, but yeah, I'm just going to sell anything for any price that anyone offers because I, I have lots of money now. I don't need to worry about this. I just want to get this store emptied. What? <gasps> oh. 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 <laughs> don't touch anything. It might actually work. I've already sold the painting. Please tell me this works because this has bugged before. If you remember in the last episode, we duplicated a bike. If I duplicated the art painting, I might need to figure out how to do this. Because it always seems to be this one that's duplicating them. Okay, does anybody want to buy that, please? No? Okay. Oh, I had another expensive camera. I don't even know where that one was. But sure, you, you could have a good deal on that, buddy. Someone just buy my clearly Sultan painting over here, please. I'm really hoping this works. All right, that is officially everything besides my totally legit Sultan painting. I doubt anyone's going to come, but I'm going to give it a real effort here just to see. What happens? All right. Well, the dream of actually having a glitch in this game help me has failed. I, I, I guess let's just grab this and see what happens. Yeah, I, I figured that would happen the moment I grabbed it. Um, I don't even care about this table. We're going to get out of here because we got big things to do right now. I am sitting with almost $50,000 for the first time in the game. Oh, man, it's been a long time coming. I've stared at this building literally every episode, dreaming of the day I turn my little flipping empire into a truly successful empire. And God damn it, today is going to be the day. I thought it was 33. It's 39. Well, it's a good thing I got 49 because we're going to need some serious cash now to fill this place. Oh, my God. Look at all the room. I like this layout way better, too. I don't have this, like, special room for him, so it should be easy to get to. I don't know what's behind this door, but I kind of want to find out. All right, guys. Well, uh, as you can see, we got a much bigger building. I don't really care about the size of the building. It's the location that I truly care about. It still says Trace Rare. Oh, man. So, yeah, we are in prime location now for quick sales if we do want to. I'm really hoping this game adds, like, a stalker or something. So, yeah, we're probably going to take a break. Uh, for a little bit as the game is being still developed. But yes, when the game does get updated a little bit, I definitely want to come back and furnish this massive store of ours. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. As always, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you 
in the next one.